these Ben's things? Most of them. Not the rope. You can have it if you want. Kind of you. Thank you. Ben went out without a gun. We're trappers, not hunters. We had the gun for safety, but it got damp. Doesn't work. Do you sleep here, Jacob? Ben sleeps here. I don't sleep. <gasps> there are maggots in the bed. Your meat's turning, friend. Food is scarce. We might do. Whatever haunts the boy spawns maggots. We should talk to this Ben fellow. He's so confused. I doubt he knows what year it is. What happened to him? Quick mist. Spun by a ghost after a violent death. Anisher row number eight. Don't get lost in quick mist, lest the spectres get you. Why? But I see no other way. Either Ben was lost in the mist, or he's the source of it. You might be able to drop down from here. I do love a drop into the deep unknown. Can't see further than the end of my arm down there. Don't worry. It'll affect your other senses, too. It's thicker than a Scots Dragoon. It smells almost as bad. Oh, wait. That's, that's better. And a little terrifying. I could show you the way. Just saying. See that? It looks like the fog is coming. Hold on. I think I can rid us of the quick mist. Oh. Well, I'm partly made of the same stuff. Sorry, I didn't know that would happen. We got away with it. Let's find what caused it. You mean, let's find out who died? Traces of a struggle. An echo hangs on it.
A drop may hide the rain. I can. I can't do it no more. On your feet, Lind. We don't no. give up. I've had enough. There's no way up. There's no way down. For days we've eaten nothing but boiled shoe leather. I'm done. We don't give up. <laughs> Leave me be. God be damned, I'm sick of carrying you! What are you doing? Don't hurt me! I hate you. I hate you! Ben died in the fall. And now his maggoty ghost is back to haunt the friend who pushed him. So was Jacob lying to hide the murder? He wouldn't be the first. We need to find the body, if the wolves haven't gotten there first. Something's here. Hidden. Oh, a shite on a short stick. Bloody hell. The lad's been torn to pieces. No, wait. He's been carved with a knife. For his meat. Still no tie. A Jacob's hovel, perhaps? Jacob was eating meat. Jacob was eating Ben. Poor, desperate, starving boys. Sometimes you must do what it takes to survive. Did we miss a few?
That Spectre's looking for a body. Let's look for our tie while Jacob's outside. I think I found our tie. How did I not notice it before? There were so many spectral stains, it's a wonder we found it at all. Come on, let's talk to Ben. Time to force the ghost to appear. You're not Jacob. Who's you? My name is Red McCraith. A Scot. You? Antea Duarte. We're banishers. We can help you. <laughs> I'm beyond help. Where's Jacob? We know what befell you, Benedict. What keeps you here? He does. He waits and waits and waits on me. He'll not face what he has done, and I cannot go. I cannot go. But I'll not hate him. How could I? We thought him lost. In mind and reason. Who'd not lose their mind? Stuck in place for weeks on end, deprived of a living, deprived of a life. Though I denied it, I saw it coming. I became... wary. Some part of me knew what he was thinking. Cause I was thinking it too. What do you want from Jacob? Do you seek revenge? I seek no vengeance. He is I, and I am him. Why do you not confront him? Why not show yourself? I did. He thought me alive. He showed me stake he'd scavenged. He was so proud. He offered me a share. He needs to face the truth. To accept what he has done to both of us. At night, he'd read scripture. God would mind us if we were good and honest. Jacob taught me that. We were good. We lived honest lives. We kept to ourselves, minded our business, and no one else's. So tell me, banisher. What did we do to deserve this? This was not God's doing. Another powerful entity is at work here. New Eden is cursed. Then God has forsaken us. 
and we are doomed. Thank you, Benedict. Perhaps we'll talk again. Perhaps we shall, Banisher. Perhaps we shall. Jacob must confess. I fear the truth will break him. You're back. You tried many times to leave this place. I tried and failed. Week on week, month on month, maybe. We went in circles. The woods are tricky, sir. Treacherous. Mean. Round and round we went. Round and round and back again. Jacob looks exhausted. We barely slept. Goosebumps. Tremors on the backbone. Felt like we were being watched. Felt like we weren't alone. How long have you and Jacob been out here in the woods? Some winters now, but this one, it never ends. No way out, no way in. We were alone, not an animal in sight. No, when things changed, we got stuck. <laughs> These godforsaken woods. Thank you, Benedict. Perhaps we'll talk again. Perhaps we shall, Banisher. Perhaps we shall. Oh, there's the Jacob. Mr. McCraith, sir? I'm sorry, Jacob, we must talk. Something has happened to Benedict. What? Where is he? What happened? Come on now, Jacob. If something's happened to Ben, say so. Where is he? Benedict is in pain. For his sake, you need to remember what happened. You need to remember what you did. But I... No. I would never... I couldn't hurt him. I love him. Jacob, look at me. It's safe to remember. Now tell me, what happened on that cliff top? I was tired. So tired. Hunger was digging holes in me. Burning in my throat, I could think of nothing else. We don't give up, we don't give in. But I wanted to. I wanted it all to stop. Yet you gave up on Benedict, and then you turned on him. I failed him. I failed Benedict. I was so angry, so angry. He kept pushing me. We kept, we argued, and I couldn't think. When I saw him lying there on the ground, lifeless, the whisper said, it was him or me, him or me. I would have died. I should have died. My sins, I deserve no better. I failed God. I failed my friend. I'm a monster. I deserve no mercy. No. You're just a sinner, begging for help. We 
we'd both faced a choice, simple and awful, to kill or to die. You struck first, and here we are. Do you forgive me? Our fates are in the hands of others now. Yes. Banisher, do your job. If you're to come back, if we're to use the ritual we spoke of, this is when it starts. Red. If we take one step along that path... Jacob is ready to die. The others won't be. We'll tell lies. We'll harvest the essence of the living. I'll shoulder the blame. As the man says, we face a choice, simple and awful. Do we kill? To be together again? Or do we part forever? We must decide now. Benedict Stoughton. In the face of life's inexplicable hardships, at times to stay alive we must do terrible things. In his despair, your best friend stole your life. Then he compounded his sin. He fed on your flesh. Confessing his sins, he offered to forfeit his life. He has told the truth. You may go in peace. We were trapped. The snare was set to kill us slow. Jacob, my friend, my only friend. I forgive all. I forgive everything. It's over, Jacob. Ben's gone for good. Ben's been gone a long time. I know that now. I need to give him his last right. Please. I need to be alone. It's 